I know a lot of people of color. I know a lot of black homeowners uh, who are adamant that they need guns in their home to protect their home. Uh, and, you know, I don't want to um, diminish their concerns. Uh, but at the same time, who the hell needs an automatic machine gun? Uh, I mean, you're really not going to use that in a, uh, to protect your home anyway. Uh, and so I think there is a place we can all agree. We just don't need machine guns. Um, yeah, but, why would you why would you sell an eighteen year old an AR fifteen? Like for I mean, just as a gun store owner, or I, I would question what do you need this What do you need this for? Well, you know, <laughs> I go back, Rake, make sure I want to talk about that AR fifteen as well. But we want to make sure that it's clear that black people, white people, they all want guns to protect their families, or they want guns yeah. to to um, because they enjoy the gun. But yeah, I mean, black people in in communities like Austin, Inglewood, Roseland, they want guns for whatever reason they want them, to protect their families. They love guns um, and they have a right to them. And so when you talk about the AR-15, do you know, doing some research, that the 18 year old that killed 19 students and two teachers in Texas, the law allowed him to buy AR-15, but not a handgun. That's the Texas law. He couldn't buy a handgun, but he could buy the AR-15. And he bought two of those rifles the day, a few days after his 18th birthday. That's the law in Texas. Most places people go out drinking when they turn 21. In Texas, you go buy a gun when you turn 18 and hope to stay alive till you're 21. Mm -mm -mm. 